Look around the world. Whether artificial objects, natural plants, or our human body, many structures spanning multiple scales exist. Such multi-scale structures have various attractive properties, like the superhydrophobic property of salvinia leaves. Fabrication of these complex structures challenges traditional manufacturing processes, while 3D printing has the potential to take the job. Among 3D printing technologies, projection-based VAT photopolymerization, or VPP for short, is famous for its high accuracy and speed. However, an inherent trade-off between printing resolution and print area exists within projection-based VPP. This dilemma hinders projection-based VPP for large area higher resolution fabrication. A straightforward method to break the print area limit is the well-known step and repeat method. The projection system moves horizontally by motorized stages, stops at a specified position, and then makes a projection. Each subarea is printed using a consistently higher resolution. The fabrication time will tremendously increase when manufacturing large objects due to the frequent small displacement and on-off switch. Later, researchers proposed a moving light approach to increase the fabrication speed. The projection system continuously moves while simultaneously projecting images. The projection system needs to refresh the mask image with every movement of a single pixel distance. Otherwise, the motion blur effect will lead to incorrect curing. The demand for high projector refresh rates, like 10 kHz, challenges most current commercial projectors and limits the printing speed. To solve the printing area limit and efficiency issue, Professor Yong Chen and Dr. Yang Xu at the University of Southern California collaborated with Professor Hua Chao Mao at Purdue University and Professor Jiaoni Partonen at Alto University and proposed a new projection-based process called hopping light. In this process, the projection system moves continuously at a constant speed, while the integrated one-axis galvo mirror rotates periodically to compensate for the projector's linear movement. The combination of linear scanning projection and the galvo mirror's rotation leads to the step-by-step -step hopping movement of the image projection along the building plane. For each step, the projector only needs to refresh the mask image once, dramatically lowering the requirement for the projector's refresh rate. The researchers utilized computer vision methods to synchronize the two different movements such that no misalignment happened during printing. With hopping light, the researchers successfully fabricated 200 mm size parts with a higher resolution of 10 micrometers per pixel. The distinguishing characteristic of hopping light is its 100 times lower requirement for projector refresh rate. For example, 10 Hz for 13.5 mm per second scanning speed without motion blur. The authors envision the large area higher resolution 3D printing ability endowed by the hopping light process can boost more applications such as biomimetic structures and wearable electronics.